Hello, Diabetes Challengers. Welcome to our channel. To beat diabetes and other health issues and get rid of your pills or even all your medications, which are not cure, not even treatment. Two major things need to be done. The first one is to eat healthy, meaning you eat real food. The second one is to stay away from poisons. And please do not neglect. A week of negligence may cause years of repair. And remember, if you don't eat your food as medicine, you will mix most of your food with medicine. So what is healthy? Substance that provides nutrition and promotes growth. Real food is whole food with a minimum of ingredients and no food-like additives. It is mostly unprocessed or slightly processed, like when we cook it. Free of non-food substances and rich in nutrients and fiber. Real foods are not mass produced and you prepare it and cook it at home and eat it with your family in one or two days, not years. Human beings have been eating real food for thousands of years. If the food has a label, consider it a warning label because real food does not need a label, meaning you have to start eating whatever supports and protects the liver and supports the gut. Now, what are poisons? Any substance that promotes disease is a poison. And again, please do not neglect. Very important thing for you to do is to get rid of the one that is of front and center. The one that is sort of everywhere. The one that you can't seem to escape. Dietary sugar. The food industry says you need sugar to live. But while you need your blood glucose level to live, you don't have to consume that glucose. You don't need to eat one gram of sugar, especially fructose. You have to cut down fructose. In fact, the liver can make the glucose you need. According to Professor Dr. Robert Lustig, who has 40 years of treating people with all metabolic syndrome diseases, in his celebrated work, Metabolical, he says, and I am quoting, you don't need fructose in order to live. There is no biochemical reaction in any animal cell on the planet that requires dietary fructose, which means you may want to eat dietary sugar, but you don't actually need it. Watch out the fruit that you consume because it's full of fructose. Eat only fruit that are suitable for diabetics. And they are in this video, which is in our channel. Stay away from bread. Bread is a big problem. Reduce carbs as much as you can and stay away from the American diet. This is William Benting, who wrote the first book, advising people to stay away from starches and carbs, which the world followed for more than a hundred years, from 1863 to 1965. And I will give you the summary of this booklet. In his booklet, he stated, I haven't felt well like now for the last 20 years of my life. I have reduced many inches in bulk and 35 pounds in weight at 38 weeks. Look at the American standard diet, which now followed by majority of the world, which is full. This diet is full of everything that is harmful for our body. Stay away from sauces because they are full of sugar. Anthony Borden said an ounce of sauce covers a multitude of sins. Stay away from vegetable oils. Although the truth about vegetable oils is generally known, people know many people still buy and consume them. Consumption rate is about 30 liter per year per person. That's too much. Very interesting is what Popular Science Monthly has mentioned. What they said on cotton seeds, what they say. What was garbage in 1860 became compost in 1870. Cattle feed in 1880, table food, and many other things in 1890. They are talking about cotton seed. Stay away from trans fats all these hot dogs, etc., etc. Fast food, fast food is a big issue. All soft drinks, all these soda and gassy drinks, and also energy drinks. Stay away from fruit juice, because when you squeeze a fruit or you, you press it, you only get water and sugar. And if you would like to know what is inside this can of soda, please watch this video, which is in our channel. As I mentioned earlier, anything with label, stay away from it. Why? Because the label is warning. It's packaged nicely, very attractive for you to buy it. It's not about the food itself. It's about what's being done to the food that matters. 
if you check deeply, if you look closely at each label, inside this product, you can see 46 grams of sugar and only seven grams of fiber. So if we subtract this from that, we will have uh, still 39 grams of sugar per serving. That's a big issue. This also goes for canned food. And if you would like to know how much sugar we consume inside this food, please watch this video, Sugar Shock in Common Foods. Do not snack, do not snack, do not eat between meals. And my question to you is, when will you start this challenge to beat diabetes? When are you going to start healthy that supports your liver and protect your gut? If you can exercise in the gym, my advice is to start right away. If you can't, just do some jogging or at the very least walking. I hope you like this video and thank you for watching. If you are in our channel for the first time, I would like you to know that we are not just providing information, but also changing and saving lives. Please be one of us and share this video with your loved ones and those you care about. And if you would like to know more about me and what will you learn from this channel, please continue watching. My name is Dr. Ali Qasim, and I have discovered that I have diabetes in 2007. Our channel is about giving you a new perspective on your health that will empower you and allow you to make healthy changes for a healthier you. Once you understand how much power you have over your health and your body, you will become excited about how much you can do. And then when you make the decision to become a master of your health, you will change to new healthier habits. Because as long as we keep the old habits that cause all our health issues, we will not get any better. Once you make that decision, you will have control over your body rather than your body controls you. I started taking my medication in 2011 until 2017. At that time, I used to take uh, four types of medication, metformin, Jardians, Diamicron, and Tragenta Dole. And in that time, my HbA1c was 10.7. And because of the harm these medication made to my body, I decided to stop taking these medications completely. At once in one night, I decided not to take any kind of medication and adjust my diet. In two weeks time, I managed to control my blood sugar from 9.8 to 5.4 or 5.5 since then until today without any medication. And I will share all the information and all the experience with you. I have studied diabetes, high blood pressure, obesity. My references for food science, uh, are Harvard University, Mayo Clinic, USDA, Food Standard Agency UK, and uh, Food Authority Australia, and other universities and authorities. I take the numbers and the research from all these sites and universities, and I will take the average and put it in my videos. And my references for medicine and nutrition are, uh, number one, the first doctor that I followed uh, since 2017, who helped me uh, to, to stop my medication and uh, treat and deal with type 2 diabetes. Naturally, Dr. Jason Fung from Canada, who has three famous books, The Diabetes Code, The Cancer Code, and Obesity Code. Thank you so much, Dr. Jason. And Dr. John Yetkin from UK, who has a very famous and fantastic book called Pure, White, and Deadly, which I will give you its summary in the future. And Professor Tim Knox from South Africa, who has published more than 750 scientific books and articles. And he has been cited more than 16,000 times in scientific literature. And Professor Dr. Robert Lustig with his famous and great book, Metabolical, The Lure and Lies of Processed Food, Nutrition and Modern Medicine. And Professor Peter Gotze with his great book also, Deadly Medicines and Organized Crime. And other noble and great doctors whom all of them, all of them are against what this man and Sir Keys has done to humanity. In this channel, you will learn scientific information about diabetes, high blood pressure, obesity, about food, uh, like fruit, like vegetables, meat, fish, spices, vitamins, minerals, and almost every edible thing. My body weight used to be 110 kilograms. And within three months, I dropped 27 kilograms. Uh, and since then, until now, as you can see, my weight is 83, which is the ideal weight. You will understand how amazing your body is, and you will learn to master your health, stay healthy naturally, and have a quality life. Not only you will add years to your life, but also you will add life to your years.
If your health is important to you, I suggest you join the Challengers family, those who challenge diabetes, and do not forget to hit the bell button so you will not miss any new video because maybe a solution or an answer to your question uh, is in that video. I would like to thank all our family members, those who join the channel, and those who are going uh, to join with my heartfelt gratitude. I hope to see all of you over the top with a healthy, wealthy, and prosperous life. Thank you for watching with my heartfelt gratitude.